Personally, I think I would definitely go to the Service Providers Summit and the Market Watch. Um, we have uh, the panels on data communications, super data centers, like to hear the wireless uh, backhaul integration issues. Uh, I'm also interested in the green networks, the, the workshops and the invited talks, uh, and, and then definitely going on the show floor to come to see how all of the things that uh, uh, we've been discussing in the many years in the past in the sessions, how does that translate into real network elements and, and networking in the floor? The other hot topic of the day that is going to be addressed in Market Watch is this phenomenal growth of the wireless network that we've seen all around us. And how does that impact the optical network? Uh, you know, the last mile or less than a mile is uh, RF, but the rest of it is connecting all of these uh, voice data, video applications uh, through uh, the wireline network. And that is very significant in terms of uh, how uh, uh, the, the optical networking plus the application layer, uh, the IP, Ethernet, is going to handle this amount of traffic and, and how, uh, how, how it will be interconnected, which is different than the traditional voice network that we have uh, in the past. So there, there's a good panel on the market watch to, to address uh, both from the, uh, especially from the service providers and, and uh, our equipment suppliers. The hot topics in the market watch program in general are basically, you know, as evidenced by the topics um, for each of the panel sessions. There's the you know, state of the optical industry, which we like to do every year. Uh, there's the, um, uh, and then we try to pick you know, some of what we think are the hottest topics, both from a, uh, an innovation perspective and also you know, as near to the market uh, you know, as, as, as we can get, right? Um, so it's, it's not the type of presentation that you'd get in a purely technical session. Well, in terms of the bright spots of the industry today, I think I would highlight the um, uh, the evidence that, that innovation has continued um, and that we have all of these topics to talk about in the Market Watch sessions uh, as, as probably one of the biggest highlights in my view, especially if you consider where we were a year ago um, with the macroeconomic backdrop that we had. I think a lot of us were concerned that innovation would come to a standstill. And I think that uh, you know, what you're finding is that um, you know, innovation has continued, uh, spending on uh, research and development in, in the optical communications industry. And I think this is, uh, you know, evidenced by the fact that carriers need uh, a lot of optical bandwidth in their, in their infrastructure to support the almost, uh, you know, relentless bandwidth demands that are being put on their networks by things like uh, wire, uh, wireline network evolution, uh, upgrade to, to triple play, uh, and wireless, right? The evolution to 3G and, uh, and 4G and beyond, which is going to put a tremendous, uh, you know, stress on, on, on their bandwidth needs uh, going forward and into the foreseeable future.